Now at 11 5 teenagers are facing robbery charges after police say they stole a car to West Charlotte gas station. The owner left their keys and an AK 47 inside the car. According to CMPD, it happened this past Thursday at the Circle K off of Old Little Rock Road. Police say one of the teens flashed a gun at the car owner when he came out to try and stop the carjacking. WBTV's Anne Haggerty joining us live from CMPD headquarters tonight. Now you spoke with people who saw this happen. Anne what did they tell you? I did, Chandler. They said they saw a group of five teenagers at that gas station just standing around near a Chevy Impala, and they were getting ready for their morning. As usual, business was getting ready to start until one man says he saw something unusual and heard this. Bow, bow, bow. I look, I see a guy chasing a vehicle. I really didn't know what was going on. And like, it was like cars at the intersection right here, and he was like, he was trying to gun them down. Charlotte Mecklenburg police say Thursday morning, a group of five teens tried to steal a car at this Circle K, right when Terry Jackson getting settled in for his work at this barbershop across the street. I was just hoping that there no bullet come through this, this window right here, and I, we kind of stepped back. And as we've seen everything, because like they had locked the bank down and everything. The scare for Jackson, similar to what other people felt in businesses close by. You're in here doing laundry and then shots fired. That's scary. Yeah, because bullets don't have any eyes. Bullets have no names. Um, they go wherever they go. I mean, it's not something that you expect. It's not something that you would necessarily want around here, especially when you have like all these businesses and you have people walking around here, driving through here all the time. Jackson says he saw bullets coming from the person whose car was stolen and the teens. I seen a young man chasing a car out here on Little Rock Road, and he was firing behind the car like, I want to say five, six shots. That's very sad. You know, that that's our youth that's doing that. Police brought out helicopters and multiple patrol units to find the stolen car. The teens later arrested two 15-year-olds, two 16-year-olds, and a 17-year-old. These kids need to quit playing, being dangerous with their lives and doing unpredictable stuff that may get them in jail, dead. You know, it's serious out here. So there have been arrests in this case, and as far as charges, there's an update in that the 16-year-olds and 17-year-olds are being charged as juveniles, and that's because of a new piece of legislation called Raise the Age that just went into effect in late 2019. The 15-year-olds charged in this case are also being charged as juveniles. Reporting live at CMPD headquarters, I'm Anne-Marie Haggerty, WBTV News.